Alex tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this cool ride on effect like this. With this effect, you can make arrows or these growing vines like the vines from Andrew Kramer's evolution pack. I think I don't know it. And yes, at first download this footage with these three arrows with the with the alpha channel. We have three parts. And this part. And now import them to After Effects. Yes. Drag and drop into After Effects. And now select them and drag them to the new composition button right here. Here. Yes, okay. Now we got this. And yes, let's start. First make the composition a little bit larger. Some 20 frames. And yes, okay. Now you can't see anything because they are black, these arrows. Now go to layer, new solid. And for example, use a white color. Color. And you got the arrow and bring this here, this part, this is arrow number two, into the right position. Yes, this looks good. And let's go ahead and get started. At first, take the pen tool go to the arrow number one and make a mask right here like me and it mustn't be perfect oh but this looks not so good Next try. To make the curves, uh, hold the hold the mouse, hold the left mouse key, and bring it up. And you got a mask like this. Now type in here. Right on. Here, we got the right on effect and drag it into the arrow number one. Now, click on arrow number one, number one, press M, sorry my brace, and click on the mask path and press Ctrl C to copy this mask path. Now, click on arrow number one and press E to bring up the effect. Now, click on brush position and press Ctrl V to paste it. And now when we go forward in time, you can see this point moves. We want to make it a little bit larger. Our arrow. Yes. Good. We got this. And now bring the brush size up. Make it pretty large and here at paint style change on original image to reveal original image now we got this and you can see this draws yes this looks really good and now do the same thing with the other parts and again at first click on arrow number two 
take the pen tool and make a mask and you got this now again right on effect press M at the arrow copy the mask path press E right on click on brush position control V we got this and now again on original image to reveal original image bring the brush size up and we got this you can bring the brush size a little bit down yes this looks better and do uh, the same thing with the last arrow piece piece again pen tool and make a nice mask like this right on press M copy the mask path press E go to brush position control V you got this on original image to reveal original image brush size up and to but this doesn't look good and we want to bring these keyframes on the timeline to the right position to make it look good at first select these three layers the fuck press U and we got our keyframes here and now let's take a look when the arrow is at the first part here we want to start with arrow number two arrow piece number two like that and when the arrow is the first arrow piece at this position here uh, the second arrow piece has to cross with this something like that yes good let's take a look here that looks good and when our first arrow piece ended here we have to make this a little bit better it has to be right here and I think we got it let's take a look yes Let's take a look again. This is not good. Yes, you can make it better at home. It doesn't look that good, but I wish you a lot of fun with this effect. This is pretty cool, I think. And yes. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, this is all from me now, fascinating tutorials, please rate, comment, subscribe and watch my other videos, goodbye.